There was one last chance for Germany to party. Pride and third place at stake in Stuttgart. Germany break. The game's still in the balance. 55 minutes played, 0-0 the score. Schweinsteiger on the ball. No substitutions as yet, so Schweinsteiger will look for a shot in here. It's a thrilling shot! It's a thrilling goal from Bastian Schweinsteiger! He took aim and it was deadly aim. He scored in the pre-World Cup warm-up friendly matches, but it's his first in seven games at the World Cup of 2006, and the 21-year-old here who has been building a reputation with Bayern Munich in the last two years, has brought Germany a lead against Portugal. Germany won, Portugal nil, and the name is Bastian Schweinsteiger. And he did it all himself. In fact, he had to evade the Japanese referee who nearly fell over in his path. But Schweinsteiger looks up here and really lets fly. And that's what they mean about this ball moving in the air. It certainly beat Ricardo all ends up and it flew between the Portuguese goalkeeper's fingers and into the net, 1-0 Germany. Another promising position. Can they go two ahead? With Schweinsteiger's free kick. Interesting, uh, the likes of uh, Closer in there. And uh, Metzelder. He'll probably go for goal. Oh, it's an own goal! It's 2-0 Germany, nobody in a white shirt can claim this one. Petit stuck out his boot, and there wasn't a hope in the world for Ricardo. It's an own goal, Schweinsteiger is taking much of the credit, but there's no way he can claim it. It is Petit own goal. In other words, a little own goal, but a big one for Germany. Germany 2, Portugal 0, surely they cannot be stopped now. Sliced in by Petit from the Schweinsteiger drive. I think he may have been going wide otherwise, but Petit has just probably handed third place to Germany. Well, it's as clear an own goal as you can see, really, that. Neuvel, a lovely turn and a run away from the defender as well, and then feeding the ball out to the hero of the night, Bastian Schweinsteiger, who looks like scoring every time he lets fly! Does he ever? Does he ever? Bastian Schweinsteiger, this is your night. Well, Jürgen Klinsmann could not have hit a better one himself. He's only been denied a hat-trick by the boot of Petit. Michael Schumacher beams as though he's just had the, the flag as he crossed the finishing line in a Grand Prix. Bastian Schweinsteiger with goal number nine in only his 35th appearance is a star of the future. He's a pretty good star of the present as well. How does he hit this one? Ricardo never saw it. It absolutely flew into the net. It nearly burst it. And we've got goals for you now. But they're all German goals. <laughs> Bendit likes Bastian. 3-0 Germany. And what a night for him. The uh, tournament lost a little bit of something when the host went out. Portugal do deserve a goal for their efforts in this half, and Figo fires a ball in, and they do have a goal! Lovely, lovely header from Nuno Gomes has stunned the German public here. It's belated consolation for Scolari, and a lovely goal for Nuno Gomes, who's 24th for Portugal. Yeah, they're happy about that. And the 3-1 scoreline was uh, something many of us predicted, and that's what we've got at the moment. And it's a Luis Figo cross as well, a beauty curling onto his head. And uh, Khan, for all his efforts, has been beaten on the night. He'll be mortified by that. But uh, just with all the other goals this evening, there was nothing much the goalkeeper could do about it. But Luis Figo with a lovely cross here, at least has given Nuno Gomes a World Cup goal to celebrate. And it's Germany 
three, Portugal won with 87 minutes played. The hosts said farewell to their own tournament with a bang. Jurgen Klinsmann's young side unable to go all the way, but they've more than satisfied expectations. The pre-tournament critics have been silenced with high-tempo, attractive football that had the nation enthralled.